What's up, guys? It's Max Jam. We're playing Rainbow Six Siege, the new map, Coastline. We're playing bomb, and then basically, I'm going to show you all the location of where all the bombs are going to be. So, as you can see right here, there are four locations of where the bombs are going to be. Hookah Lounge, Billionaire Room, will be the first location we're going to check out right here. Alright, so we are in the Hookah Lounge, and first bomb is right at the door. You already know how this is going to be. People are going to plant it right here. People are going to stand back there and just wait for your ass to get blasted. And saying that, window. Window right there. There also is one hatch. One hatch right there. And then, if I were you guys, I would most definitely blow up this beautiful licking woman licking the circle wall and shit which will lead you to the luxurious billionaire room which has the other bomb located at this room is lit you can see the whole bomb and everything these are you know walls you definitely want to reinforce right here and then there is no hatches in this room, but there also there, but there is one beautiful hatch in this room, which is comforting by a camera. So this is the aquarium room. There's never anybody would be in this room, anyways. Oh, so, all right, guys. So you definitely want to reinforce this whole wall right here. On the other side of that wall is the courtyard. And you definitely want to reinforce that because people are going to get you from the top. You don't want that. Alright guys. The next location will be the penthouse in the theater room. Second floor. Deuce Flortez. Alright guys. So we are in the theater room. The penthouse is right behind us. Wait right over here. And I told you guys a lot about this room. This room is a cluster fuck. Literally people are going to be storming in from everywhere. There's nothing you can do. There actually is a hatch there. And what sucks about this room, glass is going to be right in this ass. Right here. And then also on top of that, there's a hatch right there. It's just, this is not the greatest room to be in for bomb only because there's just so many places where people can get you at, which sucks about this room. I mean, there's so many different entry points. Glass can be right there. Somebody could be right there blowing that up. Somebody could be coming through this way. There's another area right there. There's a whole wall right there. And I didn't even start in this room. Like, let me just start in the theater room. This whole wall can be blasted open. This whole wall right here can be blasted open. Oh my gosh, I can keep on and on. Let's say they do blast this wall right here. Somebody can just cool it at the window, cool it at the steps. One of my least favorite rooms. Because it's just, it's just too, when you're rushed, it's just too hectic and everything. But you can kind of see the drift of everything. I'm going to blow myself up. Let's check out another one. All right, guys. So we are in the kitchen. Oh, man, this area is a huge room. Um, There's not really that many entry points in this. There is a window right there. And then there's a doorway right there. That so you want you 100% want to reinforce this whole thing because because behind that is the hallway and next to the hallway is the courtyard. There's so many different ways that they can see you and if they had glass on this map, glass is really really useful on this map. And if you are in the kitchen and somebody did plant the bomb right here, you're sc completely screwed because glass is a dominator on this map. I love glass on this map. But in saying that in this room, this room, I feel as though people do like to camp out this spot right here. But people forget that this wall, you can break right through it. So you're going to have to reinforce this wall to like kind of like chill right here you're gonna have to like kind of protect these two doorways you want to hope you know over there is fine and saying that i will i will personally blow up you know these two walls so you can see both of everything b is the easiest to defend only because you can literally 
defend this one person can be right here defending this whole area right here just spraying about just doing this and that and the third whatever you can just defend this right here if i was them i would probably just like i can't okay there we go i, I, I would just kind of like chill right here you know you had that spot so you know this is the kitchen and then this is the service and entry room whatever what the hell what is all this smoke all right guys so this is the last final location this is the blue bar and then the sun bar so it's both of the bars this is the blue bar area right here too many I already told you this before too many entry points all the blue walls can be breached all the wood walls can be breached terrible location there is no hatches on the this ceiling in this room which is great there is one window which is which is you know not bad you know you got this whole area you know I kind of like I tend to hang out more in this area but there is a hatch what I would do is go upstairs open this hatch and kind of like spy on this or like spy in this doorway or whatever you know what I mean which makes it easier for me you definitely want to reinforce these whole wall there you want to I think this that's the courtyard behind that let me check yes it is the courtyard behind that massive wall you want to reinforce if you don't reinforce this wall you are screwed they will come after that ass this location I feel as though is the easiest location to defend you really don't have that many entry points I can you yes you can shoot the ceiling which sucks but there's no hatches up here there's only one hatch in this game that's on the roof so you don't even gotta worry about that so but you do need to reinforce this wall you must it's a must have right here or you gotta you have to reinforce this wall or else they're gonna definitely they can see you from glass from this right here and you definitely I mean this this is an optional wall you don't really have to but and saying that, can they shoot through this? No, they cannot shoot through that, which makes things even more defendable. To be honest, if I was defending in this room, I would be behind the bar, have this bordered up, or burcade, burcade it up. <laughs> Having that, um, like that, this, it makes it easier you have uh, you kind of can see that whole window but this is a better window to see you want you would like to want somebody kind of like waiting behind that you know wall or you know just kind of this like you know that's the thing and this it's the only thing about you know being over here being in this area is that's a no-no so that's a no-go anyway so back to this so I feel as though Sunbar is the best location to defend, but the blue bar is the easiest one to take over. I would definitely 100% blow up this wall so you can see in here. So it's very convenient for you to be in here if you don't want to barricade this thing. But there is one hatch in this, which makes this a little bit you know easier to access for the enemy team all right guys so that's all the bomb locations in and coastline thank you for tuning in all right peace yeah.